It's so simple. A quick swab in the nose, place the stick into a small box, put it into a high-tech DNA testing machine, and within an hour and a half, you'll know whether a patient has coronavirus or not. They're the new tests being piloted that are about to make new waves. Previously, we were having to wait 24 hours or longer to get our swab results back. And this meant that we were needing to use lots of side rooms to isolate patients. And this means that we can actually cohort the right patients in the right places. The government's rolling out two new tests, the Lampor swab and the DNA test that can detect coronavirus in just 90 minutes. DNA nudge machines analyse the DNA from nose swabs and will be able to process 5.8 million samples in hospitals from September. Nearly half a million Lampor tests will be delivered to care homes and laboratories next week, where swabs can be checked on the spot. Both also test for flu, and the use of portable machines means they could eventually be used in the community. We're on track to deliver half a million tests a day by the end of October, but new technologies like these two will help us to accelerate that. And what that means in real life is that more people are going to be able to get tested more quickly so we can find out where the virus is and tackle it and keep those rates of infection down. But reaching the government's target is not guaranteed. Experts point out we have no idea how accurate the tests will be. For both of these tests, these are the first times these companies have produced technologies for COVID like this. Uh, so it would be good to see more evidence before we spend large amounts of, of UK taxpayers' money. And many in the care sector feel they've been here before. Only this weekend, the government had to delay a pledge to regularly test all residents and staff in care homes. Getting test results quickly at places like this in care homes is absolutely crucial so that residents can be pretty much isolated straight away. But given the huge challenges the government has faced at just getting simple test kits to care homes, I would say there is some cynicism about this new system that is due to arrive next week. I'm a little bit sh unsure how they can get all the kits round to all the nursing homes because we are a very large number of care homes around the country uh, and it will be quite interesting to see if they can manage that when they can't currently even manage the existing testing kits out to everybody. Increasing testing is, at the moment, one of the only ways to slow the spread of COVID-19. That's why there's so much riding on these new high-tech developments.